Surah Yunus, verse number 62, 63, 64. And listen to what Allah says. Behold, the friends of Allah, they have no reason to fear, nor will they be sad. So who are the friends of Allah? I want to be one of them. Good question. So Allah says, they are the ones. Amanu wa kanu yattaqun. They had two qualities. What are they? They have belief in Allah. And they have the correct relationship with Allah. They are, they are conscious of Allah. They are fearful of the anger of Allah. They always adopted the instructions of Allah. They didn't find loopholes and they always were on the safe side. Those are the friends of Allah. You're on the safe side. People are arguing about this being permissible or prohibited. Do you know what? Be on the safe side. That's what it is. People are arguing what to do, what not to do. Be on the safe side. Do you know why? You're a friend of Allah. You don't want to risk your relationship with Allah because of the argument of someone. You know, so this is very clear. And Allah says, "Lahumul bushra." For them, there is good news. Fil hayati dunya wa fil akhirah. Remember, we were speaking about uh, good news, and I said that the good news happens to be primarily the paradise. But even in this world, Allah is going to give you good news. Bashiril mu'minin in one verse, and here Allah says, "Lahumul bushra." Fil hayati dunya wa fil akhirah. In this world as well as the next, even at the point of death, they will have a good death. The angels will already inform them of the goodness that is to come. Subhanallah. So Allah says, ذَلِكَ هُوَ الْفَوْزُ الْعَظِيمُ That is indeed the massive victory. May Allah grant it to us. Ameen. Ameen, Ya Rabbil Alameen. Special friendship with Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. The one that the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam narrated in the hadith Qudsi that Allah has said, مَنْ عَادَ لِي وَلِيَ فَقَدْ آذَنْتُهُ بِالْحَرْبِ That whoever takes a wali of mine, someone that is that beloved to me, of mine, that special friend of mine as an enemy, I will wage war on him. May Allah let us be the wali and not the one being, having war waged upon them by Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Allahumma ameen. That's both very beautiful and very scary at the same time because again, because the awliya are akhfiya, they're hidden. Ali radiallahu ta'ala anhu said, Allah has hidden two things amongst the people. He's hidden his pleasure in his good deeds. So you don't know which of the good deeds is the one that unlocks his pleasure. And Allah has hidden his awliya, his special friends amongst the people. You don't know who you're dealing with. Literally, you don't know who you're dealing with when you're dealing with that person. That also doesn't mean a person goes out and commits major sins and says, well, I might just be that wali of Allah. No, no. There's a person that's striving to reach that position and then there is the person that has that unlocked for them. And, the, and Allah says, whoever reaches that position, I will wage war on the one who harms that person. Ibn al-Qayyim rahimahullah said, how many nations, how many nations have been protected or destroyed because of a wali within them or against them?